Hey guys, welcome to another video. Um, today, I've just been scavenging around everywhere for parts um, and all that sort of stuff. So I'll just show you what I've gotten today. We have got a remain seal, because that was leaking. Because um, I've pulled the cams out, I'm gonna do the cam gear seals again. Some new spark plugs, because why not? If there's any sort of fuel issues or anything, um, once everything's together and on the dyno, we'll be able to tell. Uh, just a rack boot, because that one's split. Two rocket cover gaskets. Uh, some ARP head studs. They have arrived, so that's great. Um, so there they are there. They're actually uh, three different links in there, so it's got a chart which shows you where they go. So that's all sweet. Got assembly lube. Um, yeah, so basically today, clean up this turbo. Uh, I'm just going to sort of clean up all these little parts here, so I'll just clean them up and spray them black, spray the engine mounts black, just sort of little things to make it all look a bit nicer. Um, also, I've got to clean the block up today, so just cover all these, like cover the bores up, all the jackets and everything, um, and just sort of clean this surface up, ready for the head gasket to go on. Um, head will be done on Monday, so I've got the head decked, bathed, getting the clearances done, and then I thought while they've got the buckets and shims out, uh, that I'd get them to do the valve stem seals as well, so. Yeah, it's all coming along very nicely. Um, still, obviously, so much to do. Um, but yeah, that's sort of a bit of an update. Gonna give them a spray down, just with some degreaser, then prep them a little bit, spray them up, just because it's gonna set the engine bay out a lot more. While we're waiting for our primer to dry, might get a bit of skating in. It's been a while, so probably pretty rusty, but enough of that. Alright, so the time's come to put the motor back together. Uh, head's just come back from Chris Milton Engines. Uh, had a bunch of work done to that. Ben has done an amazing job. Uh, looked after me really well. Um, yeah, very pleased with their work. So definitely be going back there. Yeah, so where I'm at at the moment, just show you guys. So we've got the head here. So I've had it decked, um, as you can see there. Uh, I've had it bathed, had the clearances done, and I've also had the valve stem seals done. Um, the head is like the least of my worries with what's going to blow up on this thing. So I thought, since it's going to probably be in the car a while, I'll just, yeah, make sure it's all good. And um, yeah, so thanks to Chris Milton's for that. Um, so the block's basically all ready to go. I uh, just need to sort of clean up the last little bits on the block. I don't know, I'm fairly happy with that, but yeah, let's see how we go. Um, yeah, so I need to put the head studs in, put the head gasket in, um, and then yeah, basically just whack the head on, torque it down, um, but yeah.
Friday, saw our heads all on uh, with our new head gasket in there. I uh, had to take the cams out to torque these down because, as you can see, the studs are sort of tucked away right in there. That's all good. So, yeah, heads will torque down, cams will torque down. Um, now I can sort of just put the intake manifold back on, like all the thermostat and the water pump, sort of all the cooling system on it. Uh, but, yeah. Alrighty, so I couldn't actually find a intake manifold gasket anywhere. So, what I'm going to do is um, make my own one. Basically just got a trace like all around this, center punch all these holes out, cut them holes out. Um, just yeah, make my own one out of paper and just put some sealing on either side of it. So yeah, we'll get to that. Alright, so we got our sort of little cut out here, chuck that on, and that's pretty well spot on, once it's obviously sitting on there, that's killer, so yeah, we'll just cut out the holes as well, um, trace that all onto the material that we're making the gasket out of, and yeah, we'll be all sweet. Alright, so here's where we're at at the moment, got all our holes punched, they will line up killer as. Um, now I just need to cut out holes for the ports. So that's all done now. Um, definitely do the job. Oi, come back here. Um, yeah, it's not something I want to do all the time. This is pretty time consuming, but it's all good. So yeah, we'll chuck that on with some sealant either side. Start putting the rest of the motor back together. So our custom gasket seems to be doing the trick. It is hanging out a little bit. I might snip all that back with a razor blade or something. Just so it looks a bit better. And I just gotta make sure that these clear the injector holes here. So I'll snip them back too. Um, yeah, so now time for like the cooling system. So the water pump, thermostat, thermostat housing, all that. Um, chuck the hoses back on under here. Get all that done, so. So we've got our new water pump on, got all our coolant necks on, intake manifolds on, uh, these coolant hoses here, oil drain, um, got our new spark plugs in, got the engine mounts on, um, fair bit of stuff to do still, but yeah, making some good progress, so yeah, pretty pleased with that. Yeah, anyways, I'll see you guys in the next one. Cheers.